movies and TV shows with damn near no flaws. Stranger Things season four. Now, I was skeptical going into season four because I'm like, bro, like we had to wait multiple years to get this season, so on and so forth. Like I was pissed off and I was thinking like, I don't even want to watch this shit just simply because we had to wait so goddamn long for it. But after watching season four, I'm very glad I watched it because it was damn near perfect. Um, you get the introduction of Vecna, pretty much. Um, he's from the Upside Down. Well, he gets put into the Upside Down by Eleven, which explains a lot of the things that happened to Eleven, you know, throughout the story. And you tie it back around to everything else that's happened before and you're like wow okay this makes sense it's starting to add up then you get the rescue of hopper uh, he comes back and then now 11 has her dad so on and so forth 11 gets her powers back um but ultimately we get we're about to get the last season where they got to stop everything that's going on which is vecna and them being the upside down not coming to the new world yeah um you had lucas performance um throughout the story and his relationship with max Whereas she, you know, had the situation going on with her brother to where she was kind of, you know, pushing him away. But now, you know, they get the discussion where they're talking about how much they like each other, things like that. And how Lucas hasn't left her side ever since she's been in the hospital, so on and so forth. But yeah, you talk about a season that took a jump after season three. And I didn't think it could get it that much better after season three. And it did. And it exceeded my expectations about what the story could be. It's kind of crazy just how much better it got. Now, granted, I wanted to see a little bit more of like Mike and things like that. But with the way the story progressed, we got to see everybody else. And I was okay with that too. Like I like the relationship, you know, with all the other characters, how they interact. So I wasn't upset with that at all. But next season, with you merging everything together, I feel like you can't go wrong at all with what's going to be on screen. So yeah.